I'm, I'm saying I'm stacking up now, so. If you're enjoying up, you know what I'm saying, us. Yes, Andre. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I'm waiting on waiting on Chelsea and um and waiting on to join us back. And um Raja Raja won't be able to join us one of my join, join late. I don't want to see um uh I'm, I'm seeing Swanee. Huh? Mm -hmm. Daniel, yeah, I tried. Um, so, so somebody can't get him now in the meantime for me. So, everybody understand everything that's going on so far with the codes? Yes, sir. Okay, all right. So, um, I, I just want a few other, per, a few more persons to come on. A few more persons, then I can go on. So even although Anal come in late, I, I can still explain. Um, so, someone want to explain to Anal this section? Hey, somebody do explain. Oh, go on. All right, that section is the part of the VHDL code, but deals with the, the circuit composition, like all of the input output gates them that is created is established in there. All right. And, it, and the name of it is called entity. And oh, then no, you give no, it no, a name. No, 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 that the name of it. Um, the, this, this section is called entity. Yeah. It, it has a name. And the, the right. name of it is, what's the name of it, entity? First, underscore class right that's the name of it so so the entity is like a function right so you start it and you hand it right here so so, so right here so the entity hen so you don't say n entity you say n first class because it's first class you're making all right um where's chase and and uh whittingham should we, go, should we go and leave them or what? I'll wait on them. Somebody want to call them back? So I think I could continue. Continue? All right. Because recording. It's recording. All right. So the architecture now. So the architecture part of it now, um, the architecture 
tell you what exactly you want both input and the output to do. Yes, and even though we know that they can take in something and they can output something, the processing, the type of processing that goes on to give you the desired output according to the input goes instead of the architecture. The architecture will tell you what you want the input and the output to do. You understand? Because we know that we establish input and output, you know. We know that you're going to take in something, but how is it going to process it? The architecture will describe or tell the program what operation is supposed to perform and the inputs and the output. All right? So the architecture can be straightforward as well as it can have in components in it. Right? And, and um, you have different type of architecture. Like you have sequential architecture. You have um, behavioral architecture and you have structural architecture, right? So architecture, the key word, structure is user defined. And most of F and we're dealing with the first class. Where's the first class? The entity. So it's architecture and the architecture have a name and I want the architecture to deal with the entity. And what's the name of the entity? First class. Right? So it's the architecture, structural uh, first class is, and you tell him what you want the first class to do. Right? So you declare a component. So how many components we have right here, sir? Only one component, don't it? It was one component we have. It's an and gate alone we have, don't it? Right. Yes, sir. So you say component. And two. So, right? so, so um, you give the component a name, and two and a store gate is so so um, this component is a subsection of architecture right i know say port io i one in right and o out standard logic so you say i0 and i1 so i0 and i1 in our input zero input one I want it to be in, right? And the standard logic is supposed to be, and the data type is the standard logic. And the out, standard logic. I close it, I end the component. That's it, and this is just a simple gate, right? You want some signal going, you want three signal, you want two signal in and one signal out, don't it? So it is basically three signal. Signal, S001, Standard logic is 002, standard logic is 003, standard. If it was if it was four or five, then you, you, you put the amount right here. So, so you're actually gonna begin structural now. So this is structural now, architecture structural, because it never the begin. We only we only declare the component. You understand what we're gonna say what, what the component to consist of. So begin structural. Remember know the name of, um what is structural? Structural is the name of the what? Come people, structural is the name of what? Of the architecture. Can the architecture name structural? You can't call it anything I tell you what to call it. Begin structural. Right? A zero zero two my point two input A. A zero zero three my point two input B. These are the input. And the output is only one output. A zero X my point two. Is zero zero one. And I realize when they put it, these are the in, so I put them at the front. This is the out, so you put the S001 after you put the out. All right? Component mapping C001 and and to get port map. A zero zero a zero zero two a zero zero three a zero zero one. Right? And this is all I wanted to do. Right? It's just a gate. Right? Now we can do something else with it. We can also we can also generate a timing diagram. Right, I'm gonna generate a timing diagram for the AND gate. I'm gonna show the timing diagram work. 
Time in diagram, right? A, B, and X, right? So, one on notice that you have um you have I and low for A, I have I and low for B, I have I and low for the output. So if we go right here, set up a timing diagram. I want to say when it is when it is low, low, and low. Right when it is when 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 A is low and B is low. What's supposed to happen to X? Make only tells what happened to X. What's supposed to happen to the output? If 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 both A and B low. Right? See, see it low? I generated the coil by clicking this and it will be said low. All right. Could go again. Suppose it is no still low, but I want this. Uh, hold on. Let, 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 let me get this part to be low. Let's stop it a little bit. Uh, this section is I. I don't want this to be I. Let me, let me just stop it a little bit. Come on, thing. Sometimes it is that could probably mean it come like it no one map on to it. Why don't want map on to it? Uh, let me see if I can put it in, dry it out. Uh, let me just go back. Uh, I'll, I'll always like, like um, to, to, to do them first, to do all of them first. Instead of just do one of them, I'm going to do all of them. I'm going to put in all of them. I'm going to put in all of them. I do it, man. Time in diagram. All right. So I'm going to put in all of them. So this is low. That is low. This one is low. This one is. Right, this is this one is low, and then this one is this one is low. And this one, I want to have this one I, and I want so so we have um, we have we have two low, we have one low and an I, what's it? So I want an I and a low now, I want an I and a low, so this low can stay right here. Just go back a little bit. It's no can stay right here. Right, so we have a low, so we have a low and low, lower I, I and low. And which one is supposed to have again now? I and I are low and low. I and I. Note it. Hello? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I. And we're supposed to have another eye right there. All right, so we have four of them now. Note it. One, two, three, four. Note it. So we can see what would happen to the output now. That is one of the output. See it? When you have when you have a low and an eye, you have a low, don't it? When you have a, a low and an eye, you can see what would happen to this. So low still, don't it? When you have a I and a low, it's supposed to have a I and low. But when you have a I and a I, it's supposed to I. You see it? Everybody see that? 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. So if I ask you to generate a timing diagram and a base deal for a gate or a combination and gate, would you be able to do it? I think so. All right. So so therefore then we're gonna we're gonna do a little bit. We're gonna do something a little bit more complex now. We're gonna do a half other. And we're gonna see what look at the half other. So we're gonna get rid of this. All right. What and what do you want for an for an half other? Somebody wanna look up want to look it up fast fast? What what are combination I guess you, you want for an, you want to get an half other? We know that we want a ZAR gate and we want an AND gate, don't it? We can take out a ZAR gate, a two input ZAR gate, and a two input AND gate. This can do. We're not going to waste a lot of time because we do this already for the digital electronics. A and A. And um, B. Goes to B. All right. So now we want to get some input. All right, for the alpha, the how many input and how many output you need? I should make a do it from scratch, you know. How many input and how many output we need? Look it up, somebody. You need A and B, and that's someone that carry, don't it? Yeah. So how many inputs it want? Um, two in two input and how many output? And two outputs. And two output. All right. All right. We could just escape that a bit. Let me bring this in the middle. It's a little bit bigger. So that everybody can see. Good. All right. So we can put two output, one output right here. We're gonna call this the sum. I'm gonna call this one D. I call this one. Carry. Sorry. Right. I need no more. Do we need to connect up now? Good. All right. So we need to connect up the input. This to A. This. This to B. No, I'm in the big loud class right now. So we'll back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, so we have some way of carry. All right. So somebody can look at a two table. I want to write in the two table. So you right here. We can write in the two table somewhere, you know. Um, but at the same time, I would mind somebody bring it up. And, uh, we can write in the two table, but somebody, somebody bring up the two table and, and, and tell me what the two table look. Let me make certain that I draw this one and everybody it correct properly. 
this one if I connect properly. Somebody, somebody wants to bring a show table. Hello. Why did not talk to me? Anybody have it yet? Anybody with a two table? Yes. All right, wait a second. What the two table say now? Huh? Mr. Zero and zero, give you what? Zero in, zero in. Huh? Uh -uh. You do that. Gio, are you that man? Soup. Anashana. Andre, Gio. Yes, sir. On the two table, two table. All right, so my AD is zero, so my carry is zero. All right, Macaroni, Tansy. I have to get a name if I can ask for the name. All right, so A and B is zero, so my carry is zero. All right, go on again now. When A is zero, B is one. What's supposed to happen? Sub is one and carry is zero. All right, there it is. All right. When A is one and B is zero, sum is one and carry is zero. All right. And both of them are one, what? Sum is zero and carry is one. All right, so that whole. So therefore then, we can stop this now and we can do a base still code for this, don't it? Yes, sir. All right. So we can, go in there, we can export the base still code and so on with it. All right. We can examine the code now, all right. How many input or how many output the right here so in, in, in the entity? Two, two input and two output. Good. You see it? Yes, sir. Right. So you can actually write a code like this because you can manipulate all these codes, you know. You can write them, but make certain that you put it in the entity. And the name of this one is first class. Right? I give it this name in the first place. Could I give it anything at all? Right? I make certain that you write it out like this. Follow the syntax. Then if you look at the architecture. What the architecture say? Component. How many, how many gears do, did we use? How many, how many gears oh. we use, people? Two gates. Which two gates we use? Uh... Oh, no, we use an AND gate, gate and a, mm -hmm. or, and a ZAR gate. Exactly. Yeah, XR gate. XR. XR yes, yes. Yeah, man. All right. So, so see both of them right here. I'm just going to copy here. So. Port. Entities so, um, two in, and we have someone carry two out, right? So, so this is the entity, right? The architecture 
component and two gate is so the component is and two and and two underscore underscore gate and the port input zero input one and the data type the type is a, is an input port so these are the label of the port and the, and the label and the, the ports are input ports standard logic out output port standard logic I end a component here it's two components two software when it's a component is they're talking about the different parts so we have an AND gate and we have a ZAR gate ZAR gate of two input port and one output port all right I end a component there all right then remember where the AND gate is only three signal don't it two input and one output but with this one we have two input and two output two input signal and two output signal so we come four right so you're gonna bring in the structure now a signal input signal s001 map on to input b s004 map on to input a zero sum map on to s002 and um, um, we realize the difference between this and this one and this 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 set out and this set out with this set out the signal are in front because signal have to go into in, into into a into b don't it but with this one right here so the signal is coming out so it is on the left hand side to signal the sum on the carry right and the xr2 uh, gates port map is 004 001 is 002 and the AND gate port is 004 is 001 is 003 so one of them work with two and one of them work with three because we should work with two s002 is for the zar gate make a look at the zar gate s002 uh, so those 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 bear in mind let me see if we can move it yes s002 s002 is work with this gate when when there is tina it um you 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 see it come right out so so the s002 work with the zar gate don't you so and the s00 oh no, let me see it and the s 3 work with the AND gate, right? And that's how it's set out and the structure, structure end. All right, the next thing that I want to do now is the timing diagram. Timing diagram, I have two input and two output. All right, so the first one is what? Low and low, don't it? I can't achieve two tables, low and low. Yes, sir. Low and low. All right. Then we we'll go to a low and high or high and low? Low and high. Low and high. So this is this, this the high already. So we can make it, we can't make it stay high. Right, and where are we getting now? High and low. High and low. Where are we getting? High and high. So I'm going to understand the point. So it is high. All right. So we do, we do, um, these, these are what you're looking at. These are the input and these are the output. But, but um, each input and output must have high or low. Is that it is high or it low? Is that it is on or it off? So when you, when when you put two 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 low two lows in the input, we're gonna see what happened down here. So in the two in the two outputs. So we can run it now. Let me just run it first and then and then come back to you, um, Andre. This is what happens. When I put when I put a, a, a low 
in the in the input A and a low in the input B. You end up you end up a low in the sum and a low in the carry. Remember when you turn on the circuit, when 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 both A and B off zero, yes, sir. The sum and carry was zero. Remember that? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, and remember that when when um A was I, um B no when A when A was low, and mm -hmm. um, B was I. What happened to to um to to the sum and carry? Remember those scale to carry low. And the carry low. You understand? See the right here, so see the sum right here, so see it I. I see carry low. All right, let me go to the next one. Oh, that was a problem, sir. Come, I never know when it I uh, when it low, when you put it I uh, when you put it low. So, so, so you understand it now? Yes. Yeah, so when it low, it's a straight line go across, right? Right. Yes. It's a straight line. See, see, see the L right here, sir. See the H here. Oh. Oh. Right. oh. Right. It, it, so it no matter if the line go up when you change it or not. Yes. Yeah, see, see it go up. Cause see, see it go up to I right here, sir. Oh. So I part. That, yeah. Right, and this is the low part, but this is but it's a deal with, with B. Yeah. This section I deal with A. All right. It's a deal with the sum, this is a deal with the carry. So both of them low now. Um so so um uh um, right here, I right, because start over again. And you read it for me. This is what? Low. Low, and this is what? Low. So what's supposed to be uh, what, what's supposed to happen to the carry? To, to the sum. See low. Right, and, and the carry is what? Low, um, I low too. Low, low, low. right. All right. We're going again. No, suppose, suppose low, low, B, yeah. B low. A, A, A. What happened to the sum? Why that? Mm, I, yes, I want to the carry. It go low. Go low. All right. I'm um, right here. So if the if B is I and A is low, what happened to the sum? Go I. Right. I want to the carry. Low. All right. Up here, so now, when 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 B is I and A is I, what happened to sum? Low. What happened to the carry? I. No, 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 no. What happened to this? Look on this. It's low and this I. Yeah, man, yeah, this low and this I. Yeah. All right. So we could look now to see if that is so. And the circuit itself. Put the circuit so where we can see it. Is that... Yeah, go up a little bit more. All right, maybe just jar down this the circuit itself safe a little bit more. Just down a little bit. All right, let me see if I can. All right, so so we can sell a piece right now. So all right, both of these um will have it in a it now hole. It now hold on to it. I I I would have to just take a picture. Right? You understand? I would have to take a picture. Right? Cause um it not it not um work both both of them both of them not working together. I have to turn off one of them. So I'm gonna turn off the, the, the um take a take a, take a, take, a, take a picture of this first. Take a picture of this. Just take a take a screenshot. I'm gonna examine it with the circuit. Take a picture of it. Let's see if I can get it big. All right. Um, that that too big. One, two, three, four. Four section they have. Turn it off. Turn off the timing diagram. Hold on, sir. Take, take, a, take a picture of it and we're going to examine through the circuit. We start spending so many spells there you know, this morning with a brimming nose. Uh, the stuff you have a brimming nose this morning. You can go ahead, no, sir. 
I can go ahead now. All right. Some, some, something burning me note from this morning. I just, I got my sign us. All right. So, go ahead now. All right. I can't do a timing diagram. I'm going to run it. And I can't do a timing diagram. This wall, don't it? You see that part in the timing, timing diagram? Hello? Is that part in the timing diagram? Andre? Sir? Uh, is that part in the timing diagram when A low and B low? So my carry low? Hola. See that? Exam examine the timing diagram. Nashana? No. Gio? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, you seeing it? Yes, sir. Thank you. All right. So I'm going to change something now. What should I change? The B? Yeah, change the B to high. All right. I know. Mm -hmm. See that now? Look at the timing diagram. Someone <laughs> carrying zero. Uh -huh. Switch it on now, sir. Switch it on now. You did the same way. Tell me the diagram, don't it? Yes, sir. All right. Look there now. Yes, sir. All right. So, so you are supposed to can do this on your own, don't it? All right. Suppose, su suppose you have to bring this from a true table to the VHDL, to the timing diagram. Can you do that? Yes, sir. All right. So, um, I think just look at the two table and be it in the timing diagram. No, no, um, use the two table to create, um, to, 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 to create a circuit, all right? Let me just show you a true table and, I, and, and I'm gonna see if you if you can if you can manage a true table here. I'm gonna show I'm gonna show you a true table and see what you can do with it. <laughs> All right. Um go back a little. All right, let me help you out with the with the lab. This true table. Um, can you imagine, can, can you, can you write a, how many, how many, how many min terms are how many max, all right, let's say, write the min terms, it should be terms, two of them, it should be the, write the min terms, how many min terms you supposed to have right here, sir? One, two, three, four, four for output one, and four for, and one, two, three, four, four each. Four, all um, right. Yes, and suppose I said to you now. No, sorry, you must do a midterm for one and then do a midterm for output two. Yes. Mm -hmm. All As right. For the con canonical. Right. Output, outputs uh, uh, and yes. Output. Oh. Right. So, so uh, you're gonna minimize. You, you're gonna you're gonna simplify this expression, simplify this expression, and come up with some gates that you're gonna combine now. So you're gonna combine it, the outputs now to get something. Okay. Uh, so 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 I wanted to start off now. Go right up to seven to to eight o'clock. Class supposed to eight eight thirty. Right. So so you are one oh one oh to so I'm gonna help you with this lab. Right the conical um the, the, the um right um do, do the do the first one, the mean term for output one, the mean term for output two. And then write the canonical form for, for both of them. Let me see. 